Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, here from good old Pennsylvania. And it's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time, people. And for note, for those of you hoping for new content here on the channel, we will be doing a lot of throwbacks to get through all the stuff I piled up. We probably won't be done until mid-January. Mid-January, at best. But it's time for another Eddie Hill review, and today we will be reviewing another Starscream. I mean, I can't get enough of Starscream, and I have several versions. But this is the original Universe Classics. Legends Class. Starscream that originally appeared in Dollar General. And I love Starscream in his G1 jet mode, and this is pretty much G1 inspired, except you can see the head. Visible head syndrome! Yeah, I got that from MGO. It's fun to say visible head syndrome. Before we transform this, we're going to do a comparison with one newer figure I have picked up. And reviewed. This is Transformers Kingdoms Starscream. They both look good together, but this is the better Legends Starscream by hands down. Now we're going to transform Starscream in his robot mode, which is very simple. Going to disconnect his null rays. And just like the Kingdoms figure, they come off. We're going to fold down the legs, fold down these panels, and fold down the other panel. Sorry about that in the background. Other and uh, her boyfriend talking. We're going to put fold the nose cone in like so. Fold down of the nose cone, give him his guns, his null rays, and there we got Starscream in his robot mode. Looking very Starscreeny. He's even got a grin on that face. I'm gonna try to on that grin. If I can get it to work on camera without it being blurry. Eh. Come on, Screamer. Come on. Oh, come on. Bit of zooming in, but I'm trying. Come on, stop being blurry. But yeah, you can see that grin now? Good. Because he's got a grin on his face like he's ready to betray Megatron and be like, I... Now I am leader of the Decepticons. <laughs> now we're going to put it back to our font, our normal font. Had to do a close-up of that face. So there will be a little close-up in this video, which I just figured out close-ups. But now we're going to compare him with Core Class Kingdoms, Starscream. And I'm going to do the transformation off camera because I'm that good with transformation sequence on memory. So yeah, that's how good I remember transformations. After messing around with them for a long, long while. Or at least about 20 minutes at best. And that's how long it usually takes me. To transform these figures. And here we got Kingdom's Core Class Starscream next to his Universe Classics Legends Incarnation. And they look good together. For Starscreams, they look good together. Would I highly re recommend this figure if you're a Starscream lover? Of that treacherous Decepticon Starscream? Yes. Pick him up. 
if you can find them for less than, uh, I paid about six bucks for them originally when he first released to GG. And I would highly recommend picking him up if you can find them for that much or a couple bucks less. And this is Eddie Hill. Moving on and rock on and rock out.